Sorry about that. Klug asked if he could send them over. I didn't know they'd be so weird. So, how are you like in detective mode? Pretty cool, huh? Honestly, it's a little annoying. <laughs> I'm glad I could help. What? You need help with the search? <laughs> it's not so easy, is it? I mean, usually someone just sends me the intel and then I tell you where to go, but still. Imagine if I was doing all this hard work. I mean, you'd, you'd be impressed. Oh, welcome back. Thank you so much for all your help. Yeah, they've been aces. Yeah, real pros. Hey, Clug! Sorry about those two. They can be a bit intense. Really, I don't know why they talk like that. But look, you've seriously done so much for me. I hate to ask for anything else, but this election is really close. And, well, keeping the G3 out of Blim, it's really gonna help me lock this in. Do you think you could, you know, deal with... Dr. Giblets? Well, yeah, no, I mean, we that's what we want to do, you know? But uh, it's just the trail went dead. A dead end? Oh, no, we can't have that. Let me just leave this map data right here on my desk. Not sure what might be on it. Oh, that's how we get to Dr. Giblets? Whoa, whoa, even if this map data did take you to Dr. Giblets, we're not 100% sure it would be his actual base. You'll still need to do some detective work. Fuck yeah. All right, then we just kick the door down, burst our way in there, find him, grab him by the neck. Hey, 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 I can't officially tell you to do that. Not if I want to win this next election, at least. <laughs> Good luck out there, bounty hunter. Uh, we will do our best. Bamboo, You're doing you great work. Thanks for helping our dad. We love our dad, Clug. They're my kids, yeah. Forgot to mention that. <laughs> Good boys, too. So you like a you like a bounty hunter? Is that fun for you? This is where our dad works. He's a really hard worker. Someday all this will be ours. But not soon. He should only live and be well. I caught one of those human movies recently. The Godfather. Holy moly, Stromboli, that movie was good. Bam, boom! Francis Ford Coppola, he's back, baby! How about this office, huh? This is where our dad works. Someday it'll be where we work. Well, that's not how politics works, but you get the idea. What are you doing waiting here? Get out of here! You ever had a man die in your hands? Genetics occasionally skips a generation. We may not look like him, but we like him. You know, we've been tailing you for a while. Next time you play the game, look for us. You won't see us unless we want you to. Because we're in stealth mode. Know what that means? Make like a tree and a leaf. A leaf. Make like a, you know. Make like a tree and get out. You like guns, huh? You, sh you shoot the gun. Find us that fucking Dr. Giblets piece of shit. How'd it go? Magistrate Club came through. He pointed us right to Dr. Giblets. That's great. I kind of regret not voting for him. Now get out there and kill Giblets. And Jill can only after. At night, when the mask is off, I look at myself. I may make the world think I'm happy, but I can't hide the truth of myself. Whatever happens, I must go on acting, acting, acting. Be a polyachola. <laughs> okay, Anton. I just thought maybe my mom and dad would be with you. Yes, I have tried everybody now. Well, I told her I'd be here before the end of this week. Okay, I'll try not to.
and Jill came tumbling after. Gary and Jill went up the hill to fetch a pail of water. Gary found out Jim broke his crown, and Jill came tumbling after. At night, when the mask is off, I look at myself. I may make the world think I'm happy, but I can't hide the. Nice to see you again, partner. You been hiding from me? They're moving pretty quick. Woo. can use my trick hole, just saying. Many as they want to. 
It's cool to have a friend, but don't forget about my dad. Hello. No problem. Thank God, thank God someone's here. I, I'm, I'm, I'm losing consciousness. Oh, oh, right through here. Right, 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 right where I was. And, uh, well, well it shot me uh, right in half. I got cut in half. A G3 base, huh? Definitely, Dr. Giblets. Oh, God. Oh, God, I'm fading fast. Please, please, please just stay with me while I die. I, I, I don't want to be here. coming to him several times. More than we could count. Don't feel bad. It just finally came to him. It's okay. It was the right thing to do. Ooh, look at that slide. All right, so this is Dr. Giblets' base. Then where's he at? Where's Dr. Giblets? Oh, I'm sure we'll be able to find Dr. Giblets with just a little bit of detective work. Let's look around for clues. Fine, if we have to. Oh, that's a lot of dead bodies. What do you think happened in here? Whatever it was, it's not a good situation for everyone who died. But it's great for us detectives, because we need a good mystery to solve. Now, go soon, a destroyed drone. Looks like it was deployed for combat. Nothing fishy there, that's what they're used for. That's what drones are for, they're for combat. That's not weird to see a destroyed drone. Someone was killing G3 mercs. You know what, that makes sense. Everyone hates the G3. I bet people try to kill them all the time. I mean, look at you, that's what you're doing. Looks like your typical work desk, nothing too crazy. Uh, uh, you know, best I can guess is someone interrupted Dr. Giblets while he was doing experiments. I don't know, I'm just throwing stuff at the wall here. Okay, yeah, I think I'm getting a sense of what happened here. Someone beat us to the punch. They attacked Dr. Giblets and all his men. Oh, we need more information. Let me hack the door so we can go deeper and look for more clues. Haha, <laughs> let's go! All right, here's my new theory. Dr. Giblets was even more twisted than we could ever imagine. He was torturing his own henchmen. He wasn't right in the head. Although I guess that's what Douglas did too, so maybe that's... Howdy there, cowboys! Uh, oh shit, sorry, wrong bit, wrong bit. I mean, howdy there, detectives! Ooh, this looks like the lab where Dr. Giblets did his experiments. There's gotta be something helpful in here. Let's get to scanning! Whew, look at all these drone heads. Dr. Giblets was an expert at creating cybernetic organisms. But we already knew that. You know, I don't think this is a very helpful clue. I do think it's neat, though. It's cool to look at fuck- Was he doing experiments on his own henchmen? Jesus Christ, that's fucked up, right? Yeah, that's fucked up. I know it's fucked up. I don't know why I asked. I knew it was fucked up. Dr. Giblets must have been losing his mind. These must be old Hyperbong prototypes. Way jankier than the ones they're selling at the High on Life store. Well, you know, we just pointed these out. Now we can move on to the next thing. All right, here's my new theory. Dr. Giblets was even more twisted than we could ever imagine. He was torturing his own henchmen. He wasn't right in the head. Although I guess that's what Douglas did too, so maybe that's normal for the G3. Maybe he was normal. No way to know unless we go deeper. I'm hacking the next door. How's it going? Yeah, Sweezy time! This room is, but I'm sure there's more clues in here, so go go find more clues, baby. Are these second place trophies? They're trophies for for what? Science? Just science in general? Do they really give out second place trophies for science? Jeez, oh boy, did Dr. Giblets write this? He was really paranoid, huh? He really thought people were trying to kill him. And you know what, uh, he, he was right, because that's exactly what we're here to do, so... Okay, he was right. Not crazy. Normal guy. We spotted another Gatlin. It didn't look so good. But then again, 
Neither did I. I look crazy. Who am I to judge? Aha, so that's our murder weapon. Dr. Giblets must have used that modified Gatlian to attack his men. It's pretty powerful. Did a lot of did a lot of damage. It'd be great if we could somehow get that Gatlian for ourselves. You think that's gonna happen? Uh, who knows? Let's find out. Okay, I think we finally cracked this case. Dr. Giblets really did go insane. He was paranoid that someone was after him, so he killed his own men. While you were wasting time doing detective work, I was busy scanning the area for Dr. Giblets and decrypting the password on his security systems. Now you can just follow the waypoint right to him. So you didn't need us to find clues. That's okay, it was still really fun. Yep, sorry, I just love detective mode so much I didn't want you to stop using it. Now go kill Dr. Giblets.